Hi, my name is Olivia Zanto and I'm from Anchorage, Alaska and I went to Faith Lutheran School there. So today our devotion is called The Sun is the Radiance of God's Glory and first we'll hear from Hebrews 1 verse 3. The Sun is the radiance of God's glory and the exact representation of His being, sustaining all things by His powerful word. After He had provided purification for sins, he sat down at the right hand of the majesty in heaven. Who can resist a baby? Its smile captivates, its warmth invites, you just want to hold it. Simeon too wanted to hold a baby, but a very special baby. He trembled when he took that child in his arms. When he looked into the child's face, he confessed, my eyes have seen your salvation. Luke 2 verse 30. He saw because the Spirit opened his eyes. Stirred by that same Spirit, he recalled the ancient blessing. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord turn his face towards you and give you peace. Numbers 6, verse 24 to 26. In a way, Simeon had never dreamed of, the Lord had enlarged that blessing. In this child, the Lord had turned his face toward him and shined on him. What generations had waited for, he had held and seen. In this same child, the Lord has made his face shine on us. For we too have seen the salvation of the Lord. To see him is to see the Father's love. A love so deep, so profound, that he sent his only son to be one with us. He sent him so that by his sacrifice on the cross, he might destroy sin and death. At his resurrection, he triumphed over them. Sin and death have lost their power. Now, he sits in glory and majesty at the right hand of his Father. But for a short time during the season, we still see him as a child. Today, he reaches out to you. Take him into your arms. Hold him close. Look into his face. Look into the face of a father's love. Even more, a brother's love. Be warmed and comforted. We often hear that Christmas is about family. It truly is. You belong to a family, all of whom love you dearly. Reserve a special place for the Christ child. Make room for him in your hearts. Then take heart, for you will never be alone. And we pray. Ah, dearest Jesus, holy child, prepare a bed soft, undefiled within my heart, made clean and new, a quiet chamber kept for you. Have a Merry Christmas!